Hello there, my viewers. Today we want to share a video on the updates concerning our hydroponic farm, uh, which is uh, based on uh, uh, a wall system. And uh, as you can see, uh, the it's uh, uh, based on uh, water bottles. Uh, but what I want to bring out to you is that if you see the growth here, there is a reason why the growth is like that. We try to use what we call organic uh, fertilizers, uh, which seem not to be a good way of uh, growing hydroponically. Uh, of course, the fertilizers here we used are uh, not organic. They are called NPK mixed with the uh, uh, calcium nitrate and the uh, Epsom salt uh, or magnesium sulfate. So you can see the growth here is different, is better. You can see that growth up there. And even the growing medium we used, we used uh, uh, carbonized uh, wood dust and rice husks. So. This is where we are on this system. Of course, you can see growth is good, and uh, uh, this one is really a very good plant here. And this is enough for you to serve your family with leaf vegetables. Uh, probably there are about 25 uh, plants here. Some didn't come out well, some we've harvested. There is another one here. We have not planted, we've just got seeds. We are trying to get seedlings. And then we've been sharing all these systems before. They are good system. I think you can see the power of uh, hydroponics. All this is hydroponics because we don't use soil. You can see that big lettuce. Of course, that is already sour. It is. The leaves are sour, but we just want to illustrate that things are possible. Things can grow hydroponically. Uh, then here we have uh, a, a kale. Kale is aging. It is aging. It's becoming old. We plan to remove it uh, to plant others. We use this as a training center. Someone might say, but why do, do you grow and you don't sell? Uh, no, we target uh, to have a research center. And currently I'm doing it from uh, my compound, but we are trying to construct what we call a greenhouse. Uh, showing you others on this side. This is more of a commercial. Uh, these are uh, systems that are called vertical systems they are based on irrigation so you can see uh, this is the modern way of farming because you are growing vertically you can make it as tall as three meters and then here is what we call the cracker method or passive method uh, which does not require pump these ones require pump this one also requires a pump. Here we're also using a pump. You can see the growth here is very good. Uh, the lettuce looks nice. Very good growth. So let us say, uh, uh, let us say, uh, uh, let us say, uh, embrace this farming technique called hydroponics. Maybe to show you lastly, uh, maybe before I go to the other side, you can see the growth up there. Is because the plants are well protected from strong uh, 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 sun, there's uh, sunlight. And uh, uh, the idea behind is that we have a small pump here which pumps water through the system, and uh, you can see the growth is very good. We have other water systems here. There's another one here. As I conclude the video, this one here, 
Uh, another one which has performed very well is here. Uh, yes, here we are trying to grow a kohlrabi. Uh, hopefully it will come out. But we've been harvesting this lettuce and we put in a new lettuce and uh, you can see growth is very, very good. Thank you very much and I look forward to sharing more videos in areas of hydroponics. I've shared very many videos on how we make these, uh, uh, these systems. Uh, they are based on water gutters. These are the water gutters. They are used for construction. But this world, anything can be repurposed, can be reused, reused for other purposes. Uh, as much as the water gutters are meant for construction, but you can use them for farming. Why not? Things are possible. The sky is the limit. So uh, thank you very much for listening to me, for viewing my videos, and I look forward to sharing more content in areas of hydroponics. And uh, this is the future of farming, which is uh, friendly to the environment, doesn't require a lot of water, doesn't require a lot of land. You don't need to cut down trees to plant uh, uh, vegetables. Uh, you uh, you don't need here even you don't need to use pumps that require electricity. But of course, in bigger settings, you need pumps. Thank you very much, and I look forward to sharing more videos in the area of hydroponics. And I look forward to uh, giving you more content. Uh, please like, subscribe, and share my videos. Make comments. Bye for now.